exercise your mind. Many kids watch TV and use devices for hours every day. Is this good for their brains? Science says that watching screens for too long can weaken a brain. A brain needs exercise. If you sat on the couch watching TV every day, your body would get slow and weak. Your muscles would lose tone. Your brain is the same way. You need to exercise your brain every day. You can exercise it by doing new or hard tasks. If you don't exercise your brain, it has a harder time doing challenging things. Reading is one of the best ways to exercise your brain. Researchers at Emory University have found that when you read a book, you don't only imagine yourself in the setting, but your brain really reacts as if you are in the book. Reading opens up the brain's sensory processing areas. In other words, when you read, your five senses are working. Your brain works to see, smell, hear, taste, and feel whatever the book describes. Your brain is unable to tell the difference between reading about an experience and having the experience. By reading different types of books, you encourage your brain to experience new things. Reading exercises your brain in new ways every time. The left temporal cortex is the language area of the brain. When you watch TV, words pass your brain without stopping at the left temporal cortex. Books are different because they do something more. When reading, the left temporal cortex pulls together all of the thoughts, feelings, and memories you have with that word. Researchers at Lund University studied the effects of reading challenging texts. They had adult subjects read medical texts for three months. Then the researchers scanned the subject's brain. Did you know what happened? Their brains grew. Their left temporal cortexes got bigger. This shows that their understanding of language got better. If you want your brain to be strong, read a book. Your brain needs to work out.